In September 2023, a Portuguese town experienced an unusual deluge of wine when two tanks holding nearly two million litres of the beverage collapsed at a distillery in Levira. The incident, attributed to a structural failure, led to the wine flooding the streets. Despite the spectacle, Pedro Carvalho, the CEO of Destilaria Levira, assured that it was good quality wine and likened the scene to a river. The spill lasted for less than an hour, and the local volunteer fire department helped with road cleanup, with no reported injuries. The distillery expressed regret for the incident and pledged to cover the costs of damage cleanup and repair. The collapsed tanks were part of an effort to address Europe's oversupply of wine, a problem affecting major wine producers like Portugal, France and Italy due to reduced consumption and exports. The European Commission introduced measures to support wine producers and reduce excess supplies, with the issue exacerbated by inflation and pandemic-related challenges. In this context, wine exports from the European Union have declined, particularly affecting red and rosé wines from France, Portugal and Spain. France recently announced a €200 million Euro investment to destroy excess wine.